Hello friends, welcome back to 7 Days to Die. It is the morning of day, day 2. I have been a busy, busy boy. I found a uh, mining helmet on a zombie. You can see I've cleaned up, I've taken out almost almost all the trees. There's two trees left in here. Little ones. I have been digging and digging and digging and digging and I think they fixed... Let's find out. They did. So they did fix the uh, uh, zombie uh, arrows going through iron bars. I think the XML was fixed. I, was like, I had not been tested. So I think they fixed that in uh, 14 years. Nurses? Die. So I... Um, I made a bunch of arrows, I made a bunch of stone axes, I made a bunch of... A bunch of everything. Um, I'll show you guys in a second here what I found. We had to... Uh, one managed to crawl over and get inside. And I killed her just before I started recording. Alright, what you got for me? Beaker! Nice! So, I have to say that um, having this in the wasteland biome was really good. Um... Because uh, I got all this destroyed stone, I got the trees, I got tons of bushes. I mean, I got most of the bush you can see. It was, I think there was three nests inside. So I've been crafting axes all night long, along with uh, gunpowder and arrows and everything else. And these uh, are now giving you scrap iron directly. They don't give you the, they don't drop as the uh, rebar anymore, which is really handy. The ones along the outside edge do not have um, graves in them. Like this row here, and that row there don't have, don't have graves. But everything else has a grave. And, oh wow, I got so much good stuff. So let's, I, I kept all of, well, let's get you out of here too. So many resources right here. I spent, uh, like what, after I stopped recording, it was like about another four hours uh, just basically gathering rocks and plant fiber and wood, getting ready for my build tonight or my overnight crafting bonanza. I can't stop collecting. Plus, all this ground is really easy to get um, stone. Look at that. I'm making a bunch of stone. Relatively low cost, high yield, and these blocks also, these bricks also, turn into a lot of uh, stone really quickly. So you can harvest stone like mad in the wasteland. So that's the one good benefit of it. Uh, when I stopped recording last night, I was also really near a little town lane. Town lane, yeah. All right, so got everything out of there. So, let's go look in here and see what I got. So, out of the coffins, I got those five schematics out of how many? Um, maybe like 40 coffins? So, that's a great return on coffins. Let's go ahead and read these up. So, shotgun... Rocket launcher, which I think is one of the most worthless early game <laughs> items to have. Uh, leather pants. Candle bars. Pistol. And then we got our beaker and everything else that we got. So, we... Yeah, I like it. A lot of supplies.
So I'm not going to keep all of that stuff with us right now. Actually, I'll take that and my where's my uh, some wood. Yeah, four thousand wood already. I will grab this. I'm gonna make some torches. I'll bring this with me, and I'll bring stone with me so I can make arrows as I run around. And where's my feathers? Feathers, 60 feathers left. Okay. So our next goal, we have 10 hides. We need more hides so we can make it a, a uh, get rid of that. So we're up to 247. <laughs> See? Easy. Easy cheesy. I want to make cotton. We have beaker already. Glue. Duct tape. We've got blueberry seeds, goldenrod seeds, corn seeds. So far. So far, so good. Um, I am hungry and thirsty, so I'm going to grab the water. And I guess we'll go ahead. And, uh, I'm going to save this honey in case I get infected uh, since I don't have anything else. Let's go ahead and make... Um, a campfire since that's the next stage in our craft in, in our quest log and we're going to go ahead and just char uh, a couple pieces of meat yay earn a skill point okay so we're just going to yeah. that should be enough Try this up. Eight times it. Yeah, should have enough meat to get that done. You're all good. You're decaying away, which is nice. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and make a bunch, make the rest of those arrows, and then we'll make a new bow. One. Cool. And now we're thirsty as a mofo. Zero. Okay, turn that off. Don't need any zombies coming by. So water is now officially a problem. We have nothing else to drink other than that one beer, which not really helpful. So we've got to find water. I'm going to bring this with us in case we find a pool of water and we can at least boil up some stuff. So, all right. Now I did, like I said, I found, uh, I didn't get too close to it, but I found a uh, town-like thing over here. So we'll head... We'll head that way. And keep the eyes open for more um, birds' nests. So far, so good. Um, yeah, my opinion of the wasteland as far as a starter with that, with that to be your start, because it's pretty freaking secure. I mean, with the, with the, uh, uh, what am I trying to think? With the iron walls, it's a pretty secure little place to start off. Spending the night there was not a bad idea. I want to keep my eyes open as well for patches of uh, coal and potassium again. And I want to gather uh, a lot of cotton uh, for crafting. Start raising my uh, tailoring skills up a little bit as well. Now, I've got some skill points that we earned uh, overnight. 
uh, during our crafting bonanza. So let's go ahead and spin those. Grab the rest of this cotton right here. Cotton picking awesome. Zoom, 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 zoom. These little areas, they've really switched the uh, proportion of of uh, goldenrod around a lot. So much more cotton than they used to be. Mash the E button. Mash it. Look at I can't. Uh, yeah, there's so much cotton. Oh my goodness. All right, we're we're just about done. We're just about done, folks. I can feel it in my bones. Bear with me. You'll cotton to me. I know it. <laughs> Bad cotton puns. All right, that gives us plenty of uh, goldenrod as well. Again, we need a, we need a pot. So we can start making some goldenrod tea, which will stretch our water supplies out markedly. All right. Wrong, it's been this way. Okay, uh, 130 cotton. Oh, wow. Uh, so we made those new, we can make 11 more. Uh, let's look at the skill points. So I've got 16 points available. <clears throat> I'm thinking this sexual tyrannosaur, I think, will be really nice. Health nut requires minimum, maximum wellness by 10 points per rank. That's kind of cool. But sexual tyrannosaur is really going to be handy now, I think, early on. Because you can regenerate your stamina faster, which means you can run longer, you can mine more. It's actually really beneficial. Um, and then scavenging, we're at four. So I want to get that up. When we get to 10, then we'll buy a, 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 line, a, a rule of that. Uh, minor 69er, also be good. More damage and less stamina for mining. So that's really cool as well. So there's some really good new um, perks in here. And of course, once we get to 20 on our uh, construction tools, then we can unlock our workbench, etc. So again, more awesomeness. And we could pump that up, and that would unlock, hmm, unlock 9 mil, I think, is the next one to unlock there. All right, what are we wearing? It's so, hello, Zom Zom. Let's take the shoes off. All right, uh, I'm also going to go ahead and make a new bow, because now we've got all that, oops, yeah. And then we'll turn all these guys into cloth fragments. All right, keep going. Don't get distracted. Stay focused. Eyes on the target. They've changed like the minimum or the minimum distance for looting, it seems. So you gotta be a certain minimum distance away to loot. Which I hope they change. I'm not gonna get deer on the way there. I do want to get some deer I'm envisioning that we're going to probably switch and live there. Why did I go for her first and not him? I'm going to need to make a, uh, a new weapon soonish. Just to save uh, on arrows. All right, let's grab this. That's the idea. I was gonna make some torches for nighttime recordings. 
especially in mining. Oh my goodness, mining has become so dark. Yeah. I don't really want to kill every zombie in the world, so. It's a really pretty area. I'm really liking it. Trying to spot nests and bears. Bears so I can avoid them. Alright, so I'm not sure if this is a town or if it's just one of those little, um... Uh, oh good. Leveled up. Must have raised, uh, my athletics or something. And we've got another bow, another, yeah, another bow in our inventory, which is even much better. Ouch. I was worried about how close we were back, I didn't want to back into that bow. I couldn't remember just how far back he was. All right, so let's, yeah, 226. Nice. I think that there's a bug in Alpha 13.6, or yeah, 14.3, 14, 14 whatever Alpha this is, Alpha 14.3 with the random gen, because I'm seeing a lot of these kinds of little buildings, which are, are like, they're just three buildings, and it's a little T junction. Not T, a little cross junction. So you don't get much. There's not much to it. And while you're down. Ah. Ah, damn, oh, over his shoulder. That was right in his face, balls. Oh, no. I'd like to lose some of these guys, too, really. I would, I would, I would. So let's go back. Before that guy despawns. Unless he already has. He hasn't. Yeah, I thought I heard a crawler. Definitely a little more exciting with uh, having playing on survivalists. So, pardon me if I'm a little. Quiet. Come back here and see. Okay, come on. 
Come on, buddies. Come on out to the street again. Ah, wasted shot. Probably put some points in the archery. I think I hear something to my right. Hey, come on! Down the heart, twenty arrows. You have mine up like this, and you can't really miss, can you? Except I can. I have the ability to miss. Check these guys. Especially that nurse. Like I want to try and leave her the last, just in case. Almost there, we almost got a ball. Yeah. All right, that was about about a hundred arrows, about ninety, probably yeah, ninety arrows. Her beaker, nice. Beakers used to be so rare. And also, they used to have so much more use. Now that now that uh, antibiotics are fairly easy to come by, it's a little sad, you know. Wow! I just realized how much time I use on that. Oh my goodness! He's up like half the day. Oh, more zombies flying in. I mean, that was literally... I wonder if it's if you're too close to him. Yeah. The arrow, like, spawns behind them. There's a laser there. Oh, come on. That was... You can see the arrow, like, go right into their faces. Yeah, I think it's like a min I wonder if there's a minimum distance now. Oh wow, that's a lot of stuff. Okay, let's go ahead and scrap and eat and scrap and eat. And we're full. This should be the last guy. It's a little light rainfall. So I wonder if most of the shots on these spiders or these crawlers ends up being like legs instead of torso or head. 
Just the way they the way they sit. Right, let's see what else we can find here. Ah, we're running out of time! No no! Oh potato. Potato So we've got all of our farmables now. Now all we need is a wrench and I'll be a happy, happy, happy Rongo. So I'll go ahead and loot this up. Um, I think what I'll do as well, I'll run back and grab our gear and we'll make this our new home. At least for the short term. So I think this will be a better... Uh, it's not better defended, but I don't want to be in the wasteland. So, if you don't want to be in the wasteland, then being somewhere else is probably a good decision, I guess, to make. Alright, check that out. Check this guy. Don't want that. Don't want that. Still have a problem with water. Water problem. Ask, ask me a question. Da, 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 da. We got a bookshelf and a desk. Another handlebar schematic. Nice. Didn't I have to wait forever last season for a handlebar schematic? And I've got two by day two. Random loot. Random, random loot. Um, F you. Where are you? Keep cool. Grab. Eat. I want to try and finish that looting with you guys. Um, I remember there was a duster there. All right, yeah. So I will, um, I will haul things back here. Just scrap. balls. Alright guys, if you guys enjoyed this episode, you know what to do. Give me a like, give me comment, comments, tell your friends, your families, your grandmamas. When we come back in the morning, we'll loot up that place. Uh, I'm just going to haul the stuff back for now. Uh, maybe given, if, given time, I may do another little scout around, see if there's anything else of note in the immediate uh, vicinity. Uh, right now, my big thing is I need to get a wrench. Wrench is pretty much my saving grace. So anyway, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye-bye.